Okay, so this is essentially your 360i, okay? And what's different about this is that this is a four-way stopcock instead of a three-way. So what that allows is that after, you know, you might turn it off and you hook up your line, your normal saline, you bleed everything and you zero your uh, transducer. And when everything's done, you turn this over like this and you open up all the way. And then that stays open. On this end, what we have is a couple of one-way valves. And then we have um, a line that's going to our, uh, to our contrast. And because of the one-way valves, what happens is that when I pull back on my syringe, it's automatically going to pull from my contrast. It will not allow anything to be pulled from this end. And then when I inject, the valve will close and open up this way, and whatever I inject is going into the patient. You'll lose your, uh, you'll lose your, your line, your pressure line, for just a few seconds while you're injecting, just during the injection. As soon as you're done injecting, then you're gonna have your pressure waveform back and you'll be able to read. Yeah, and, and you can pull and then you can inject again. So it's just a pull and eject. There's no more turning stopcocks to fill with saline or with uh, your contrast or anything else. It's just pull, fill with contrast, inject into the patient. And you can go push slow, you can push fast, you can do small ones or you can do big boluses but it's nice and it's simple and it gets rid of using all these stopcocks except for when you're actually doing your bleeding your lines and that and you have two more ports so if you wanted to add something else then you could but otherwise it's fairly simple that's it